find the deflection at the tip of this beam, which has an overhang. So by intuition, the deflected shape would look something like this. And let's draw the bending moment diagram over here. So if you cut the beam from right to left, you're going to get P times L, which is a force by the moment arm, which is a negative bending moment of the support. On EI, gives the curvature diagram. And at a pin, the bending moment is zero. So this bending moment reduces linearly to zero as follows. So here we'll take point A, B and C as follows. So we have a tangent at A, a tangent at B that looks something like this, and a tangent at C that's more steep. So if we extend the tangent at B as follows, it looks something like this. So this distance is a tangent at A relative to B. And this distance here is a tangent at C relative to B. And by similar triangles, this triangle here has a length 3L and this triangle here has a length of L. So by similar triangles, this distance here is a tangent at A relative to B on 3. And therefore the tip deflection is equal to the tangent at A relative to B on 3 plus the tangent at C relative to B. And because the curvature diagram is piecewise linear, we can use a geometric definition of the tangent. So for example, a tangent at A relative to B is equal to the centroid by the integral from XA to XB of the curvature M on EI with respect to X. So if we take our origin on the left, then the centroid of this triangle is at 2 thirds by 3L. And the area under the curvature diagram is obtained using geometry. So we have X bar multiplied by half the base which is 1 half by 3L by the height of this triangle which is minus PL on EI. So that gives minus 3PL cubed on EI. And that tangent at C relative to B can be obtained in a similar way. So if we take our origin on the right, the centroid of the curvature diagram is at 2 thirds L. So we have 2 thirds L by the area under the curvature diagram, which is 1 half by the base by the height. That gives minus PL cubed on 3 EI. And now if we substitute these in this expression, so the tangent at A relative to B on 3 is minus PL cubed on EI. And then plus the tangent at C relative to B, which is minus PL cubed on 3 EI. And this here is the same thing as 3 on 3. So the deflection at the tip is minus 4 PL cubed on 3 EI. Please subscribe, like and comment to help me reach more students.